When you use the DocEv audit controller to retrieve audit information from SharePoint and store it within our reporting databases, you may periodically want to go back and clean up that data. That is referred to as audit pruning. To do that, we log into DocEv, click on Report Center on the left, and then go to Settings. On Settings, up at the top, we click on Audit Pruning. We must then select a scope that we want to prune for. I'll select a web application in this case, and then we click New. We enter a name. And an optional description if necessary. We then tell it what we want to prune. Data older than, in our case, let's say we have an internal policy that we keep audit data for one year. So all data older than 12 months, I tell it, okay, we no longer need to maintain that. We can go ahead and delete that. You can delete the data. You can also move the data. So if you wanted to export it, for instance, a DocAv export location would be available if you wanted to store the audit data for long-term storage in a spreadsheet, as an example. And then we can put it on a schedule. So how often do we want it to prune and when do we want that first job to kick off? So I'm going to have mine kick off at midnight. And let's say maybe we want this to run once a week. So once a week, it will go into our captured audit information stored in the DocAv database. It will search for any audit data in there that's 12 months or older, and it will then delete that data, pruning the audit data in our database. Down at the bottom, if I click on Advanced Data Selection, this is where we can target exactly what's going to be deleted. You can specify users to include in the deletion or to exclude from the deletion and their audit data. You can also decide what actions to be removed and uh, not to remove. So as an example, perhaps I don't want to delete any of the permission actions. That could be for compliance uh, reviews as an example. Down at the bottom, if everything looks right, we click on save and I can execute for the first time if I wanted to right now by clicking save and run now. But I'll simply click on save, which means the first time this will run will be tonight at midnight to prune our captured audit data.